in the in this little duo that you do with Maddie whereby Romeo death and Romeo start to to sort of merge and she's seeing not only her lover but with morphing into death we have to somehow signal that you are just in her little hallucinating mind I'm sure we can do that with lighting I'm sure we can like do it with too. green makeup we will. <laughs> <laughs> when you commission a new ballet it's, it's an exciting process and because we have worked with Graham and Janet now so long and his experience as a choreographer is so immense, the thought of what can we do with Graham that's going to, you know, challenge him, challenge us, challenge everyone. And I think his great talent of telling a story in a narrative is, is a, a very unique form for ballet, or for dance, in fact. From here, I just wanted shaken baby syndrome. I just want from here you actually um, lift her onto, onto a little, no, not, uh, um, it's still on the floor but onto point, just lift her up to there and I just want to shake the shoulders so, so that you have to really relax so that it's just completely flop for me. And I would love it on point 30, it's taking you out and bringing you back in. So oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's try it on flat. Crack? Did I hear a crack? So I, think, I think we need Ooh. to just keep it more um, contained, yeah. like yeah. a vibration. Ooh. That's yeah. beautiful. Oh, That's better. Yeah. The vibration's oh, better. Oh, oh, <laughs> what I love is the challenge of finding a new way of interpreting a story that has been reinterpreted a million times. Everything from West Side Story to a Baz Luhrmann production to a million ballets that have been done on this subject. Nice and slow and under and rond. The challenge rond. now is to find a rond. way that excites a new audience. And under. For me, the fascination of dealing with Romeo and Juliet, which is known to everybody as a famous Shakespearean work. And ponch. Finding a way beyond words, because dance is not dealing in words. Beautiful. Ron, I love that. <laughs> Keep going! One more! <laughs> See, you're not under control. <laughs> <laughs> it's that is so <laughs> nice. He's using the foundation of what we do, you know, the classical ballet technique, but he's always challenging it, he's always updating it, he's Just always finding it. new ways of using that technique and I think that's why his works are so relevant to the dancers today so loved by the audiences today and he really gives us a whole new look at what ballet can be. That was great. Basically I think we can get her into that position but you can also support her into that. On my belly. On your belly. On, on your belly on his shin, on their shins. Just roll into that, that's it. Now keep going back, boys. Pull her. Push, lift her legs. You know, to collapse into a heap laughing when something goes wrong is a much better way than to collapse in a heap of tears. Okay, now just extend your legs up and hold, support her. Laughter is a physically relaxing thing. If you have a tension, an unnatural tension in a rehearsal space, you get rigidity and not flow and not relaxation. If we got to that position here, the act of lowering might actually allow us to oh, do yes. that. Yeah. Okay. That's a big question. The classical ballet is traditionally you fight gravity, you defy gravity, you float above it, you get on points so that you don't look like you're attached to the floor. Contemporary dance really loves um, that is the source of your jump, that is the source of your energy. You're, you're like a plant taking nutrition out of that. These dancers can do both. Well, that's a beautiful position, Vaughan. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have to accept that you are going to one minute be way above the floor and the next minute groveling on it. Extend, bring the legs down, using that. I love your work. Oh yeah. And when, the, when you've done that, the dimensions change. You're in a third dimension. You are just going in and out. And that's a beautiful thing. Yeah. Okay, and relax. Put it down. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, great. Mm -hmm. That's good. That was great. <laughs> okay, let's have a little play.